1964. Right, slight change of plan this morning. Uh, the trailer I had on was required back in uh, Scarborough for MOT. So initially I was going to drop it in York and they'd get somebody to pick it up there. But because my load wasn't ready in York either, uh, they said to um, bring it straight through to Scarborough. So that's what we've done. Six point two miles. Um, I've got a full load of timber on now, a load of plywood for hull. So I thought I'd take you on this little trip with me up Staxton Bank. Because it's a uh, hell of a climb. And I've never had the truck this loaded before going up here. So we'll see what it's like. 17% it says there on the side. Whether you can see that, yeah. 17% keeping low gear. Uh, it's just rained as well on a dry road, so that's not going to make it much fun. It's probably going to be quite slippy. Anyway, let's see how we go on. She's down at fifth gear. That's us tipped in Hull. There's the Humber Bridge again. Heading back up to uh, York to collect a load for Berwick. But uh, he did say East Midlands at first, though he did say he might change it as well. And uh, Berwick is certainly not the East Midlands. That was nice and quick. The trailer was already loaded, so just a trailer swap. Drop mine right off. Look at the weather. Be beautiful blue sky there and black rain clouds. You can see the rain blowing in over there. Oh uh, well. So, one drop Berwick. Uh, I've got three and a half hours left before I need a break. And three and a half hours will take me to nine hours. And three and a half hours will also take me to a 13 hour working day. So that'll do me absolutely fine. It's half two now. So I'm looking to get parked up for six o'clock. Uh, hopefully north of Newcastle. Well, rather ironically, 12 hours later, uh, five o'clock this morning, this is where we started, and it's now five o'clock at night. We've come in a full circle. 
uh, been down to Scarborough, across to Hull, back up to York, reloaded, and we're uh, about a decent run up to here. I was hoping <coughs> that we wouldn't catch too much traffic, and in fairness, it's uh, 10 to 5 now. Uh, this looks this looks fairly good. So with a bit of luck, I've got well 6 o'clock. I'm going to get well north of um, Newcastle and the roadworks. That's the main thing. And I, I, there's a spot I've been wanting to try up near Annick. Yeah, that's where we parked last night. Just at the back of Sainsbury's there. Team Valley Trade Estate. Spot on, made it to this little uh, park up I wanted to try, we wanted to try this for a while. Uh, it's up near Annick. there's a pub that does grub over there, there's a McDonald's, there's a garage, there's a Morrison's, little industrial estate, it's quite tight. Uh, obviously if, if that bit had been able to be used we'd have, we'd have been alright but they've, they've got these rocks across here I guess to deter travellers and stuff. So there's only space for two guys there but I managed to back down this little side road um, it's a it's a dead end if you can see in my mirror there it's a dead end anyway but there's a um, there's no there's no trucks that come in here so it's just cars and I, I'll be able to swing out in the morning past that guy there so uh, yeah looks decent enough handy little space just off the A1 uh, and 30 miles up to uh, Berwick drop in the morning. Right, that'll do me. Good night all.